How's it going? I'm Julian Taylor, and a moment in music that changed my life would have to be when my cousin Ronke gifted me her guitar. It was a old acoustic nylon string guitar. I must have been about 11 years old, and uh, she could see that I was into it. She was learning how to play at the time. She was a bit older than I was, and um, first she let me borrow it, and then she handed it off. So, kudos, and thank you, Ronke. So without a doubt, the biggest game changer moment of my life and career was when I decided to leave music school. Despite my whole life in music leading me to that point, something about it just didn't feel right. So I ended up leaving school, taking a tour with a local Toronto artist and going to Europe for the first time. And that completely changed my whole thought process. I wound up leading me to walk off the earth. So I often think about, had I not gone out on a limb and taken that leap of faith and gone with my gut, where I would have wound up otherwise. So there's a lot to be said for that, trusting your instincts and of course as well, surrounding yourself with people who love and support you. I remember the first time I saw my brother play music to a crowded room and I remember the room falling silent and thinking what a strange power that is to have so many people listen to your words and your stories and I told my brother I want I want to do that. So he gave me his guitar and he said, well, learn then. And I think that was a game-changing moment for me. Game-changing moment for me was March 16th, 2015, when I went to see One Bad Son in the Wild at the Red Dog in Peterborough. I had such a great time that I saw them twice more that week. And it really sparked a love of indie music and seeing small bands in small venues. This has led to a really cool thing called Live in Diane's Basement, all thanks to my favorite band from Moncton, the Motor League. It was their idea. We're touring bands, stay at my house, and play shows.